What's up YouTube, this is Prince with ATP 101 and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to remove the Topanga jailbreak from your device. So even if you delete the Topanga app, you will know that you had the Topanga jailbreak if you still have Cydia. You see Cydia is right there. And Topanga is basically the only jailbreak that gave you Cydia on your device. But ever since the Electra jailbreak and Coolstar have been saying he's going to release a Cydia within um the Electra jailbreak he's saying that if you add Topanga jailbreak this might be a conflict because they already gave you Cydia so if you you want to remove it basically and the cool thing is the developer of the Topanga jailbreak he basically updated Topanga so you could remove it so from the app so he made an Xcode project which is only for Mac but somebody made an IPA and you guys could use this one on Windows. I'm going to use the IP. I have it linked in the description. And I also try to get the Xcode project if you want to do it like that. And you're going to need City Impactor. So basically, same thing like, same as how you install the jailbreak. This is how we're going to do it. We're just going to install the new IPA for Topanga. And within this new IPA, it's going to have a remove Topanga feature that's going to remove it. But you still might have City on your device. You might have to clear UI cache and do all that kind of stuff to get rid of the app. But all the files and everything will be gone so you will be good after you do this process so links in the description download everything plug in your device turn off two-step or two-factor authentication on your Apple ID you don't need a valid Apple ID for this and yeah so let's open up CD Impactor okay so if you get the little question mark right here it won't work so make sure if you get that, just unplug your device and try to plug it back in. Make sure the name of your device, there you go, the name of the device show up. So you want to drag the IPA, the Topanga IPA that you downloaded, right there. And let's let it do its thing. It should pop up wherever you had space. Okay, so there it is right there. That's the Topanga app. So we're done with this right now. We hit X. Open up the Topanga app. And if you look, you see it says tap to remove Topanga. So you have tap to jailbreak, but well, now you also have tap to remove Topanga. So we're going to do that. Tap right there. And it says removing Topanga. So I made a video showing you guys how to do the Topanga jailbreak. So that's why I'm showing you guys how to get rid of it if you want to. Because if you're going to use the new Electra to get um, Cydia, that will be a problem. So I'm going to show you guys how to move, remove it. And that's basically how you do it. Just download the two new Topanga IPA or Xcode and just run it. Done. So now it's saying reboot. So basically, we just want to turn off the device and turn it back on. and basically that's it that's it guys so that's all to it that's all to it. even though you still have the Cydia app right here all the files and everything is gone you could still remove the Cydia app and if you have the JJ app on there you could still remove that and if you want to remove the Topanga you could just delete it just tap on the X like that and it's gone so there's nothing to that one but if you want to remove the Cydia app you're gonna to have to run UI cache basically that's UI cache let's go to um, a cyber duck or whatever your SSH client is in fact I'm, I'm gonna do that I'm gonna show you guys how to do that you're gonna to need to be jailbroken so we're gonna use the Electra jailbreak to jailbreak we have an update but I'm, I'm gonna use this one you want to use the Electra jailbreak or the Liberty jailbreak so now we're going to be jailbroken and once you're jailbroken this will give you SSH so you can, now you can see my device looks a lot different 
I mean, so now we're jailbroken. I was gonna use CyberDuck on a computer, but it's a better way and a faster way to do it. This was CD right here. Now it just turned white. So if I open it, it's just gonna crash. So yeah, so I got an app. It will be linked in the description. It's called iTerminal. So you wanna tap on it. This is what it looks like. You're gonna hit SSH and you're gonna put in a nickname ATP 101. You can put anything for your nickname. And the host is your IP address. So whatever your IP address, just basically go to settings and go to your Wi-Fi and it's just tap on the I next to your Wi-Fi and it's gonna show you your IP address. And mine, hold on, hold on, go back here. And mine is one nine two dot one six eight dot two dot eleven. So yeah, that's mine and then Right here, or it has the two two. You want to have the, want to add two more twos, so it should be four twos. Our username is root. Always root unless you change it. And then the password is alpine a l p i n e. Right, done. You want to hit connect. And there you go. So basically, we have SSH into our device. And to clear UI cache, all you want to do is just type in. U I C A C H E. Should I type in U I cache? And you want to hit return and that's pretty that's pretty much it. That's it. You type in UI cache, you hit return, and then you respring your device, you exit out. You turn off your device, or you could just respring within the app by typing kill all minus nine springboard, and then it'll just respring. But I'd rather just turn off my device and turn it back on. Boom. There's no more Cydia. Cydia was right here. And it's gone. We could search for it. Yo, I hate this. Damn, pop up every second. Yeah, there's no more Cydia on the device. It's gone. So that's how you get rid of the Topanga jailbreak. Get all the files out of the system and get rid of the Cydia app to get rid of to get ready for basically whenever cool star update updates Electra with Cydia so that's how you do it guys let me know what you think in the description is Prince Day TP 101 check out my Valentine's Day edition earpods video link in the description deuces